Oh my god, these trailers! I mean, it's not a bad thing, but when I want to talk about a trailer that I'm super behind on, another one comes out. They just don't give us time to process all these trailers. And the new Jurassic World trailer is new evidence to that, and I have to talk about it. So the new Jurassic World trailer shows Chris Pratt as the dinosaur whisperer. He like stops them with his hands. I remember seeing that exact shot in the Super Bowl trailer, and I was like, eh, I don't know about that. But he goes on and he says it's not about control, it's a relationship based on respect. Which I can sort of get behind now, it just adds more character elements to Chris Pratt that he truly cares about these dinosaurs. Thing is, does Chris Pratt's respect towards the dinosaurs make the dinosaurs respect him as well? It's the questions you gotta ask. I mean, it's a meat-eating animal. You never know if it's just gonna snap and bite his dick off. Then he goes on and says, these animals are thinking, I gotta eat, I gotta hunt, I gotta... You can relate to one of those things, right? Which that right there is the reason why Chris Pratt is awesome and easily one of the biggest stars in Hollywood right now. He makes these really off the wall sex jokes. They can be funny, but Chris Pratt, he can pull that off. Then Bryce Dallas Howard goes on and says, every time we've unveiled a new attraction, the attendance has spiked. Then you see in one of those attractions where the people are like watching from a log window and there's a goat standing right there is all like, hey, eat me. Imagine they recreate the scene from the original Jurassic Park where the goat's leg lands on top of the car. But this time the dinosaur just grabs a hold of the goat leg and tosses at the log window and boom sticks like putty in front of a lot of men women and children and you see that big ass fish from the first trailer eat the rest of the shark people are all cheering i'm like i wish there was an attraction like that that would be awesome that was awesome see even that kid which i don't know his name he agrees with me they go more in depth with the villain in this movie which is the genetically modified dinosaur that goes batshit crazy and one guy that kind of reminds me of george takei sulu he's all like she's designed to be bigger than a t-rex which gives us that feel on how huge this monster is gonna be i mean we We've seen it, but like we feel it now. You know, it does make sense, whatever. Chris Pratt asks, well, what happened to the sibling? And Miss Howard's all like, oh, she ate it because she got hungry. I need a quick snack, so I'll eat my sibling. The shit just goes from peace to anarchy as this uncontrollable dinosaur gets loose and just starts tearing people apart. Even the dinosaur was like smart enough to take the tracking device out of its system and Chris Pratt's like, oh, she remembers where they put it. And there's a huge ass field of those long neck dinosaurs, which I honestly don't know what they are. I feel really stupid not knowing. I forgot some of my childhood, how dare I? Then we learn to find out that this dinosaur is killing for sport. That is when it turns to pure anarchy inside Jurassic Park. I bet Bryce Dallas Howard feels pretty stupid afterwards because she's basically the reason why all these people are dying. And Chris Pratt says, if we're gonna do this, we're gonna do this my way, which yeah, listen to Star-Lord guys, he trains raptors. You have to admit, this shot's beautiful. Which I'm not so entirely sure whether the raptors are gonna be on his side or not because one dude tells Chris Pratt, oh, they're communicating with each other. So is it gonna be like the main villain dinosaur gets out and then it communicates with others and joins forces to start eating everybody? If I'm right, it shouldn't have shown that in the trailer. It kind of feels like a spoiler. However, I feel like they haven't shown enough to make you go like, oh, I basically watched the entire movie. Thanks, Universal. It's not a bad thing, really. I like going into my movies with surprises, and yes, even for a Jurassic Park movie. I'm still gonna see the movie because, I mean, shit, pterodactyls are taking people off from the ground. Hey, at least I know that one's name. Have you guys seen the new Jurassic World trailer? What did you think about it? Whatever your thoughts are, leave a comment below. And as always, there's a link for my Twitter and my Facebook in the description as well. Keep in contact with me. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. But in the meantime, I have to get going.